So since this trailer's probably gonna piss me off a little bit, I don't know if you guys saw my reaction to the teaser trailer, which, teaser, come on. The teaser trailers are just full trailers at this point. But I don't know if you saw it, but I did it with my beautiful wife, and I was trying to be really objective about it, and it, it just, it just wasn't, I, I didn't like it. I mean, it's, it's volcanoes, they go off like once every, what, like 100, 200 years? It, the, the likelihood that there be a volcano that is ready to erupt on the island or near the island, uh, no. And then the likelihood of there being a an inactive volcano on the island in the first place. Why would you pick that location? I'll tell you why. It's called circumstantial bull crap. And you may have heard me talk about it. It's actually the biggest plague in films today. I'm telling you, circumstantial bull crap is when just random things just so hap just, they just happen to be there, and they, it happens because it's got to move the plot along, and it's got to make it more exciting for a completely unrealistic and unreasonable reason. We associate volcanoes with dinosaurs, and dinosaurs with volcanoes, so we better put a big freaking volcano on the island where they brought dinosaurs back. Because it's only fitting for a movie. Honestly, if this movie is as terrible as I am unfortunately expecting it to be, then screw Lost World, screw Jurassic Park 3, and screw Jurassic World, even considering that I found it a fun film, the magic of Jurassic Park is gone. The most magic that I've seen since then is the stupid Super Bowl commercial with Jeff Goldblum and the Jeep. That was awesome. Maybe I'll make friends with this new Jurassic World trailer. Guess we'll find out, right? Do you remember the first time you saw a dinosaur? Oh, blue. We don't really believe it. It's like like in the music. A miracle. Special effects are better. Something's than coming. It's a T-Rex. It's a T-Rex. It's, it's not a T-Rex. Blue, come with me. You know you can't stay here. Jurassic World. The island. You're all right. Easy, girl. All of that is in the past. Am I dead? Not yet, kid. I want to show you the future. What is that thing? They made it. Blue! They made another one. You need to get us out of here. Yeah. No, I'm not gonna try the Jurassic World effect on Facebook. What? 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 What happened to Jurassic Park? I mean, it, this is a monster movie, and they're doing the same stupid thing again. Jurassic World, I let it pass because they were like, you know, the events of Jurassic Park happened. We're gonna do it right this time. And I was like, oh, I guess no one's gonna listen to Ian Malcolm. Life uh, finds a way. How about frickin' screw life, and we're just gonna do whatever the frick we want. Well, then they, they made a hybrid dinosaur in Jurassic World. I was like, oh, that's pretty cool. Stupid. It's pretty cool. They did it again. Jurassic World was a failure because you decided to make your own dinosaurs. And so uh, Jurassic World's in the past, so they are just like, ah, screw it. Let's just start making dinosaurs anyways. You know, it's just going to go to crap anyways. People are going to die. You know, whatever. Yeah, this is stupid. This is plain dumb. This movie is going to be... Complete trash. I'm usually not this pessimistic about movies. I really am not. But the whole thing looks absurd. Volcanoes making. I'm making the table shake. Sorry. Oh, it's like Jurassic Park effect. It should be still. The car's bouncing up and down. They got volcanoes. They've got dinosaurs that they made. And they're back on the. Why are they back on the island? Sam Neill never did return. He did. It was a dream. Remember? Alan. Uh. Alan. So, Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom trailer 2, uh, have you seen it? It, you know, tell me what you thought about it. 
below because, it, you know, believe it or not, I still do care to know. And to get more face explodingly awesome reactions from my channel and reviews, I'm not dead, I promise you. Just change cameras, change location, change lights, change software. A lot of changes, you know, it being, it, it's a hard life as a YouTuber. Just saying. But if you want more of that stuff, then hit the daggum subscribe button, and I will see you next time on Movie Slayer.